All right, we're here in the U.S. Air Force Base. Um, we are going to be taking care of this post-construction cleanup. I uh, just want to show y'all this is kind of like the office view for the day, all right? Y'all stay tuned. Hey, hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Dwayne, Clear Moment Pressure Washing, Clear Moment Supplies, Clear Moment Custom Trailers, all right? Today, we're on base again. I think we did a video a few weeks back, maybe about a month or so back, where we were doing another part of the base, and I kind of mentioned that we were going to be taking care of some post-construction cleanup. And that is a part of our um, job as well. We do a lot of post construction cleanup. So today I'm gonna take y'all on a roundabout. We're gonna be taking care of a flat mesh membrane roof. So we're gonna show you guys the steps it's gonna take to go ahead and wash it, the chemical we're gonna be using, and uh, and things like that. So we definitely appreciate it, man. Uh, let's take a look at it. It's a brand new roof. We're gonna be cleaning it on up. This is some post construction cleanup. Clear moment pressure washing, clear moment supplies, clear moment customs. Y'all have a blessed one, all right? And hey, don't forget, like, click, subscribe, all right? Subscribe to us, man. Like I said, we got a lot of content. We are uh, we trying to grow this thing, man. Uh, like I said, happy the house. We're trying to have happy residents, happy houses, and things like that, man. So that's what we do. Appreciate it. Y'all stay solid. All right, this is the area that we're going to be cleaning from the exterior point of view. We're going to be doing this complete flat bottom roof not up top that's brand new we're gonna be doing some post construction cleanup all right all right I got everything dressed on up I am about to go ahead and pass over uh, this drop line to where we can go ahead and run up our power wash hose all right I'm gonna do a little quick turn and let you see how nasty this roof is and like I say this is a flat bottom mesh membrane roof we're gonna clean see all that red clay Looks bad. Let's see if we can get it cleaned up. All right, we have the final results of the hydrogen peroxide. All right, it looked like it was gonna lighten it up, but overall it did not. All right, it did not. This looks like a complete scrub job with the hydrogen peroxide. All right, now, like I mentioned before, we are doing this work and we're on the, at the, uh, excuse me, the Air Force Base. So we are doing this for the US military. So all of our chemicals have to go through protocol. We have to send our MSDS in. Uh, so the whole nine yards in order to get this stuff approved to actually use it. Of course, we've done several of these roofs before, but we could not use our approved chemical, okay? We couldn't use our proof. I mean, we couldn't use our chemical. Now that they see the peroxide is not going to work, I get to go ahead and send in my MSDS on this stuff to where we can go ahead and get it approved. This to make sure through the roofer that it will not violate the roofing terms and in turn void the warranty. So you're looking at this stuff right here. I, I mean, don't get me wrong, which I knew it before. Peroxide is more based on organic growth, all right? Organic growth. Algae, mold, you can clean roots with it and things like that. I figured it was not gonna do it on this, but of course, when the US military tells you, hey, we want you to try this, and they're paying you a ton of money to do it, you are going to do what they ask you to do, all right? Until it don't work. So like I mentioned in the meeting and the briefing before we came out, that hey i don't think it's gonna work i'm gonna put it down so now we put this stuff down at a 50 percent ratio all right we tried a couple of cups to a gallon like the instruction says we tried it exactly like it says but it did not work all right it did not work now i want y'all to see a little spot that i just used like a little test spot for what we actually use on this roof how you're going to be blowed away now look at this look at this test spot look at this crystal clean all right you see this crystal clean so our chemical works that we have peroxide will not work on the red clay stains at all it will lighten it up yes now we're not sponsored, of course, by any particular company, so I'm not gonna put that 
hydrogen peroxide company on here, but nonetheless, you see it in the results, which the roofing company actually recommended. Recommended, excuse me. The roofing company recommended it, but uh, they obviously, I mean, they put roofs up and install them. They don't clean them. We clean them. All right. Big difference. Big difference. Like I say, just to cap this bad boy off, we are on base, as you can see. We have the soldiers, they're getting ready to do their, uh, this is the JAG building, so this is officer training over here. So this is where the officer training happens at. I uh, got my guy down here, he is taking care of winding up all the holes. We still have all this mud and things out, and we are fighting the concrete man right now. So hopefully tomorrow they don't have all the trucks in where we can literally get back and take care of a lot of this stuff. But like I say, man, it's Dwayne signing off, man. We're on Maxwell Air Force Base. Uh, we are doing the post construction cleanup to this uh, JAG building. We've actually just came on out not long ago and power washed this building over here. All right. We power washed quite a few of the areas, did a lot of flat work. So now this is the new addition where we're at. So once again, man, like, click, subscribe, man. Subscribe to us to go a long way. I'm trying to really get on out there, man, and really put more uh, content up about what we're doing in the process because we do a lot of odd type of jobs, different kind of jobs that most power wash companies don't consider. All right? We are uh, on this same day today. We literally got a request to clean some, I think, 70-foot tanks or something like that. Um, that a client came on out that's a part of the construction crew and just literally mentioned it to us Hey, can you clean some 70 foot tanks for us? So I will be heading over the next few days once we get this correspondence going and let them know what's what man So like I say y'all fellas y'all this uh in this wash game doing what's what if you happen to come across a roof like this and they tell you hey use hydrogen peroxide Because it's it's eco safe. It's eco safe. Yes, but is it gonna clean? Unless you want to be out here cleaning, because this, this is just one side of it. We have this side, and it's another side, a part of the uh, back side of it. Unless you want to be out here with a mop and some hydrogen peroxide, uh, I wouldn't recommend it. Okay? Let me turn this camera around. All right, like I say, so we got it done for the day, man. Uh, we go, we got to head on back to the shop. We're going to go ahead and regroup on everything. And we're gonna see how everything's going. Like I said, it's Dwayne Clemon Pressure Wash, Clemon Supply Store, Clemon Custom Trailers. Y'all have a good one.